we're back with a brand new music video this time we got something a little bit more sad we channeling it's it's sad boy hours now you know what i'm saying we got cry baby from lil peep this song has actually been out for a while now but we officially got the official video now and it's just so sad what happened to peep you know what i'm saying peep is another one of those artists that was taken from us way too soon this man od'd on some lace drugs or whatever that was yo and it's just so sad to to hear what happened to peep i wasn't really a peep fan back before he had passed i didn't really listen to anything from him you know what i'm saying i was familiar with him but i never actually listened to any of his music but i do know that he did have a lot of really loyal fans who actually really cared about him really loved his music and were really hurt uh when he did pass away so we gonna see what's up with this track. Hopefully, this is a banger, but I've heard a lot of good things about Lil Peep, so we just gonna have to see. If you guys like this video, make sure you spank the like and subscribe button and ring the bell so you guys get notified whenever I upload. And if you guys have any suggestions of videos you would like to see me do, make sure you leave those down in the comments below because I'm open to anything. But without further ado, Lil Peep, Cry Baby, official video. Let's see what we got. That wasn't loud enough, I said. Santa Ana, how you feeling tonight? I got my brother, the cutest dude ever. Oh, uh, yeah. He goes by the name of Lil Peep. Y'all remember that? Ascana, come on, Shay. Ascana. The Cry Baby one on my forehead. It was kind of like a push for myself to like uh you know almost like force myself to be successful with like the music i was doing every day i see him it just keeps me really grateful for everything that's so sad man Now, I said this at the beginning, I never really ever listened to any Lil Peep songs before, you know what I'm saying? But I do know that he's one of sort of the pioneers of sort of this, you know, emo, you know, depressing sort of, of hip-hop, you know what I'm saying? Him and X were really popular in this sort of style, man, and listening to it for the first time and actually like listening and hearing what he's saying and listening to him, you know, delivering his stuff. I really was missing out, man. My man Lil Peep definitely is talented. He's definitely got a lot of talent, man. And I can hear all of the potential in his music, man. Even though I've only listened to this song for about 30 seconds, 45 seconds, I could already hear that he's that he had crazy potential, man. So it just makes it even more sad about how he passed away. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Okay, so so far it just sounds like he's singing about a girl you know what i'm saying typical typical hip-hop stuff singing about a girl heartbreak you know what i'm saying love of his life whatever but i want to just talk about something really quick he said in at some point in that verse he said you know she want to get high too i love to get high too you know what i'm saying and i think that's you know one of the biggest issues in hip-hop is this glorification 
of, you know, these this crazy drug use. You know what I'm saying? We all know Lil Peep passed away from drugs. Juice World passed away from drugs. Mac Miller, you know what I'm saying? So the, the glorification of drugs has really been hurting people. You know what I'm saying? Because people, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's projected in this movie and portrayed as, oh, this cool thing. Oh, hey, look at me. I do Zans and all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know what I'm saying? You got people who, who end up like Lil Peep. You know what I'm saying? They... They, they OD, you know what I'm saying? They take the wrong thing, whatever, and then it's over at that point, you know what I'm saying? So, drug use is definitely, I think, one of the biggest issues all around the world, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people who, who struggle with drug addiction and drug abuse and things like that, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like if you know somebody like that, you got to get them the help that they need because, you know what I'm saying, it's nothing ever good comes out of this, you know what I'm saying? So, definitely... Provide the help to people who need it because there are definitely people out there who need a lot of help. Man, this this dude is just so talented, bro. Just sitting here listening to him just hurts my heart, you know, to just know that we not going to get any more beautiful music from this man, Lil Peep. But one thing that I noticed in this video and also just noticed from my time on the internet and stuff is that Lil Peep was never afraid to just push his boundaries and just be himself. You know what I'm saying? He's got, you know what I'm saying? He's got the tattoos. He's got the pink hair. He's got the painted nails. He sings about whatever he sings about. You know what I'm saying? He was never afraid to just be himself. You know what I'm saying? He received a lot of criticism back when he was alive. You know what I'm saying? Back when he first started, you know, blowing up. If you would even consider blowing up at that point. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people criticize him for just being himself. So I got I have mad respect to my man Lil Peep because he was never afraid to just be himself. And I can always respect that. Man, it's just so talented, bro. Oh, I'm a lonely boy. She made a lonely boy. Yeah, I know. Oh, it's a lonely world. I know. Go and get a lonely girl. That's for sure. my heart bro just seeing that bro is that it that's it bro 
Yo, man, that's that that whole video just made me all super upset now. Yo, I said at the beginning, bro, this man, Lil Peep, he has so much potential, you know what I'm saying? This is the first actual full song from Lil Peep that I actually sat down and listened to, and I can definitely see why he was able to build such a strong and loyal fan base, and it's still just so sad to, to see and hear, you know, what happened to him. And how he passed away from us way too soon, man. Rest in peace, Lil Peep, bro. This song was absolutely beautiful, man. Definitely was really loving it. I loved the way he was performing it. I loved his style, loved the vibe. I loved everything about it. And the music video was super dope, too. It wasn't just like they just took a bunch of random clips of Lil Peep and just clipped them all together and threw a song on it. You know what I'm saying? They actually took clips and and footage from when he was performing live and it at you know what i'm saying his performances actually synced up to the actual track and they were all cut together and it actually seemed like one coercive music video so i thought the video was super dope and i really liked that part there at the end where it just went straight acapella and it was just a little peep and his fans and they were just vibing out and just singing their song singing their souls out man and that that definitely hit me bro definitely hit me man but overall man this song was absolutely beautiful i thought the music video was amazing man Lil Peep was so, so talented, man, but I really enjoyed this track. Let me know what you guys thought of this song down in the comments below. Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did you like some of it? Did you hate some of it? Let me know how you guys are feeling. I'm interested to hear what you guys have to say. Like I said at the beginning, if you guys have any suggestions of videos you would like to see me do, make sure you leave those down in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure you guys spank the like and subscribe button, ring the bell, Rest in peace, little peep, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.